Okay, so it tells me that oxygen is a, a simple molecular covalent substance. And it wants me to explain why it has a low melting and boiling point. So the key to this is that when we want to melt this, we have to break these weak forces of attraction that exist between the molecules. And because these forces are weak, they do not require a lot of energy to break. So the marks that we're going to be looking to get here are that we can say that the molecules are held together by weak forces of attraction. What does that mean in terms of energy? Uh, this means it does not require a lot of energy to break them. So therefore the melting and boiling point is low.